Hello everyone. So this will be my first time reacting to Boondocks and never seen the show before. It's going to be a lot of fun. Make sure to subscribe, hit that thumbs up button. And if you want to follow me on my socials, I'm Malik underscore zero four and I will be in the description below. In the description right now, this is our first time. So hit the like button. We get a thousand likes on this video. We'll do a part two. Oh, that. You just stepped on his hook. His hook? Dang. Hey. That's like low-key childhood PTSD. Yeah, that is. <laughs> Phone on the steps. <laughs> yeah. He said, no, no. <laughs> hey, yo. What the hell? I ain't doing nothing, Granddad. I would just go go to Ed's house, and Huey said I couldn't go because he a hater. What the hell <laughs> is wrong with you, Huey? If your brother wants to play with Ed and Rummy, that's his business. Granddad, mm -hmm. Ed and Rummy are the national criminals. There he go, hating again. Hating. Oh, <laughs> what about the time when Riley and Ed were playing with the loaded shotgun, and Riley loaded shot, shot Ed out of a second-story window? Loaded shotgun is crazy. That's not even nothing to play with. Not even the BB gun. Like, damn. Not even a, not even a BB gun. That's not even nothing to play with. Don't use it. Don't try this at home, y'all. <laughs> Dang. He really black. <laughs> okay, so just because Ed believes in his Second Amendment right to bear arms, we can't be friends? What you got against the Bill of Rights, Huey? Okay, how about the time they stopped for gas and ended up robbing the Mini Mart? Hey, they doing a lot of criminal stuff, right? They was fighting what? terrorism, making the world safe for the freedoms that we enjoy today. That's messed up. You don't support <laughs> the troops, Huey. That is kind of messed that up, That is messed Huey. up. That is messed up. Be back by dinner. Said be by dinner. Do CPR. CPR. Look at his mouth. Yeah, I'm not sure yelling at him is gonna help, uh -huh. Granddad. How do you not know CPR? I tried to learn CPR, but they wouldn't let me, cause I was black. What? <laughs> now and y'all can just run around and learn CPR whenever y'all want to. Just go around saving lives, resuscitating each other willy nilly. I feel like CPR is very important, though. Do you know CPR? I don't. I mean, I know it like from reading textbook. I've never taken a class on it, but I feel like everyone should. He's like, that can save someone's life. Hey, yo, I, I can't resuscitate you from here. <laughs> you better wake up. Dang, that's I'm crazy, you. man. You ain't saving me. Look what she's doing. She's I not can't. saving me. Dang. Uh, you gotta you gotta fly me out to save you. That is true though, but I'm already passed out already. Look. I would look, I would have been done <laughs> right there. I guess you're dead. Yeah, I'm My dead bad. right now. Dang, yo, I'm dead in the comments, y'all. But when <laughs> I was a young man, it used to be against the law to teach colored folks CPR, okay? Man, that's not true. Granddad. Is that you? Oh boy. I thought we lost you there for a second. How was the Luther? Best thing ever. <laughs> so you fell back out. To me. I mean, they ain't really doing it. Again, fall down the steps. He loves it. Fall down the steps. He's worried about his shoe? Yeah, that's what I said. Why his shoe? <laughs> He's like this, I fell man. Down the steps. I gotta go to the hospital. <laughs> He's like, you I don't care. Going to that hospital. No, really. I can't get up. Where's the love? Dang, that's messed up. We know why he can't go to the hospital. We get that. Huh? Dang, he just hit on. You ain't going to that hospital. Uh -huh. Get go your little butt up. Try to pull that bull jive on me. Come on, get it, get up, get up, get up, get up. Come on, come on. Did you have parents? Your parents do that to you? Like every time you hurt yourself, you said go to the hospital. Did would they? Would they? Yeah, take it? I grew up like with my parents believing like unless you're dying, we're not going to the hospital. Hey, man, I thought it was just in black families, but hey, in your family no. too, though. Hey, so y'all yeah. in the comments, she's saying the same thing, man. You got to yeah, like, I, <laughs> I broke my elbow once, and I didn't go to the hospital for like a week late till a week later. Oh, yeah, they bad parents. I'm just playing. They ain't bad parents. A week <laughs> later, crazy. Where is your glass, boy? Glass? I don't need no glass. I take mine to the head. Oh, yeah, here is true. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you can't cut your mouth. You gonna drink out, put your mouth on my containers. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you got a waterfall at least. Yeah. Supply of vitamin C. Ow. Dang, he slapped that. Boy, have you lost your mind? 
How are you going to drink my orange juice out of the garden? I don't That's know what, what I'm saying. your nasty lips have been. I know one thing. I ain't going to the store to get no more. See, I was like all in the granddad's mental mind. It was like psychology. <laughs> oh, shoot. You trying to play my games. The store and back. That's it. No hospital. Take my phone so I can reach you. But don't call anyone. That's that OG yeah, phone right there. Dad, is that a cell phone or a cordless pay phone? Shut up. <laughs> this thing looks like a laptop. Hey, you don't know nothing about that. No, I had the cordless phone, the hospital. walkie talkies. Like, I had I all that shit growing up. Nearly a week it passes the shooting, and things seem like they was back to normal. You were looking for hate. Way to go. Shut up, punk. Instead of being Mr. Funny Nigga, why don't you try being Mr. Helper Nigga? Go jump the nigga and get his chain back. Man, I gotta find a way to get it before Thugnificent finds out. Riley, let the chain go. If Thugnificent wants it back, he can Dang, handle it. Chain. Then he'll think I'm a punk and kick me out the crew. It's just rocks and metal. It's only worth what you're willing to give up for it. Is it worth getting hurt again? It's not yeah. worth it. Chain, all that. Yep. No, getting it killed. Never yes, it. sir. Kissing a man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Whoa. Kissing a man. Hey, Kissing yo. a man. I mean. He Kissing said, a man is crazy. Kissing a man is crazy. Can I take your chain? What you do if I'm taking your chain? What you gonna do? I'm gonna buy another one. See, that's how you, the mentality you gotta have. You got another <laughs> one. You gotta have mentality, bro. You gotta you buy another one, bro. If it feels natural and that's what you're into, I mean. No, that don't count. That's a do-over. I didn't know you was gonna say that. Guess you really want that chain back. No. The answer is no. Death kills us like crack kill Pookie. What? Like switch a nigga kill Tuki. <laughs> Chewbacca was a Wookie. Was this supposed to be poetry? Boo. Hey, Eric <laughs> about Dewey. That was Dewey. real gay, my nigga. Cut that out. Shut up, Riley. What's wrong with you, Cairo? <laughs> that nigga's corny. Corny? Nigga, you're corny. At least he's here. Why don't you go follow your punk ass granddad back to Whitesville, fake nigga? Oh, shoot, you just socked him. Damn. Don't run, nigga, I see you. He's chasing this man now? Oh, yeah, this is getting rowdy. Rowdy over here, okay. Boy. Yo. Bro, they're so violent. They are. Telegraph your punches for a blind nigga to see him coming, granddad. Riley, the man obviously had a heightened sense of hearing. Oh, I thought granddad had a heightened sense of falling. No, that's enough, man. You can stop laughing at your granddaddy. It ain't that. What's wrong with you? Granddad had hit me written on his forehead in prayer. I said that's enough. Okay. What you gonna do? Beat me? Maybe I should get a blindfold first. Oh. Okay. Ready? <laughs> Wait, Man, that's messed maybe up. Maybe he gonna fall it's crazy. on me. <laughs> Riley, stop. <laughs> Granddad, Roddy Key just called and said, Damn, I <laughs> thought I got my ass whooped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. It's over now. Oh, I never thought about a hole for a grandma. She coming to school on a career day? It's crazy. Yeah. Though. What's she gonna say? What's she do for a career? <laughs> What is she gonna say, bro? Crazy. Have you ever like had somebody come like from your family for a career day? I was homeschooled, honestly. So. Oh, okay. They have you. <sighs> I mean, I feel like everyone's thrown a tantrum. This is just like part of being a kid. Yeah. But, like, if, if your parents didn't punch you good for that, they failed. They did. They you sure? That's for sure. <laughs> oh, they gotta put this sad commercial on. Why? <laughs> what? Are they in church working? No, is this in church? Oh, this is, oh, this not, this court. What the hell is wrong with you people? That's Every what I'm saying. famous nigga that gets arrested is not Nelson Mandela? Yes, the government conspires to put a lot of innocent black men in jail on fallacious charges. But R. Kelly is not one of those men. We oh, all know Kelly? nigga can sing. But what happened to standards? What happened to bare minimums? You a fan of R. Kelly? You want to help R. Kelly? Then get some counseling for R. Kelly. Introduce him <laughs> to some older women. Hide his camcorder. But don't pretend like the man is a hero. Hey, I like that little speech you just had. <laughs> and stop the damn dancing. Act like you got some goddamn sense, people. They, they act like they had no sense at all. Don't like around here. One of y'all like to explain this. They got that uh, by. You mean the orange juice or the mini skirt? Which one of y'all drank the last glass of orange juice? He always doing That's that. That's the last food they supply of vitamin C. What am I supposed to do about my vitamin C now? Y'all need to start appreciating you your granddaddy. 
I went and spent yeah. your inheritance on this beautiful house in this neighborhood. And all I asked you to do is act like you got some class. Hey, Learn some what's math. class? And this is a thing. It means don't act like niggas. <laughs> see, see, that's what I'm talking about right there. We don't use the N word in this house. Granddad, you said the word nigga 46 times yesterday. <laughs> I was you may not like it. 47 but times. I moved y'all out here to expand your horizon. There's a new white man out here. He's refined. For example, did you know that the new white man loves gourmet cheese? Wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> did you say cheese? Yep, cheese. You give the meanest white man a piece of cheese and he turn into Mr. Rogers. Granddad, that doesn't make sense. Don't you talk back to me, boy. Granddad, you can't tame the white supremacist power structure with cheese. Oh, yes, you can. <laughs> no, you can't. Yes, I, can. I, I mean, <laughs> to a certain extent, now, I, I get tired of that. Sometimes, like, some women nowadays... They just go on a date just to get a free meal. I know it sounds crazy, but some women just do that. Just to go oh, on a nice dinner. Yeah, I, I've I've heard so many guys who have taken women out, and it turned out they were just doing that for the free meal. Listen. I don't know. I'm someone who believes like I pay for a first date always. Like unless the guy won't let me pay, I always pay for like a first date. For real? I do, and bro, I also not, don't I like just go on Yo, dates. I don't understand. I like look <laughs> in the comments, bro. I really like this woman, bro. Like she's one of a calm down. We're exaggerating. This woman can't be, bro. Her birthday is like a day after mine. This is weird, y'all. Should we date in the comments? Put in the comments right hey, now. Hey, you. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. Let me stop. Let me stop. I might be burning bridges right now saying that. <laughs> Ladies, just stop playing right now, though. All right, let's go. Should it's I come over to crazy. my house tomorrow after school and watch TV? No. Do you want to come over and play video games? No. Oh, that's mean. He said no to Do you want to come over and have a jump rope contest? I'm going back home to Chicago. Oh, Chirac. No, I wish. We're going for a funeral, one of my granddad's old friends. But I'm going to get to see my best friend, Cairo. Cairo is your best friend? Yeah, but I haven't talked to him since I moved. Look at her looking so How cute and innocent. How can you be your best friend if you never talk to him? I don't think I have a best friend. Oh. Huh, sucks oh. for you. Sucks for well, you? What? I'll never come back. He's so I'm mean. <laughs> He's so mean, ain't he? She was being all nice, Ew, offering him stuff. Miss Dubois, your peach cobbler look like throw up. Boy! Ugh, though. It do look! That's peach cobbler? It look like throw up with peas in it. That's what I'm saying. That's not peach cobbler. Who cooks mm. like that, bro? Yeah, that's oh, not. Man. Can you cook? Of course I can cook. I'm Middle Eastern. Oh, yeah, okay. She can throw down, y'all. That's what she's saying, man. Miss Dubois, yeah. you been eating peas. What? No, Come here. What is her. wrong with you? What's wrong with me? What's wrong with her? Aye, she aye. the one who brought vomit over here in a Tupperware container. That is not oh, vomit. Shoot. It just looked like vomit. Yeah. Now, apologize to Miss Dubois. Um, it just it, looked it, like it's vomit. It's okay. <laughs> really? Miss Dubois, I'm sorry your peach cobbler look like vomit with peas. Damn it, boy. Why do you Please. say that? You don't have to. I don't care you if you beat me, granddad. I won't eat it. That is disgusting. Disgusting! <laughs> it's completely uncalled for. You'll eat it if I have to hold you it's down and shove it down your throat. Really, I didn't mean for it to be. I, I know what you try to do. You try to kill me. I hate you. <laughs> oh, you switched the switch you on him. I don't want to eat that dog. Like I don't want to eat that dog. Damn, he kind of deserved that whooping though. Yeah, that was mean. He didn't have to say all that. Out of sympathy, she came to see the game. She wanted to be entertained. Wait, who's that? Oh, the white woman got a bit. Who him? Please put in the comment yeah. section. I watched some of these. I don't know every episode. I only watched a couple of episodes when I was younger. I don't know every character name. But everybody put in the comment section what his name is. That The guy with the suit or him? No, the, the guy with the suit. He's like, wasn't he on a date with the girl? I think so. No, 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 no. That was an older man, I think. He's got a big heart. Oh, my bad. <laughs> oh, he was on a date. Okay, you was right. You was correct. Look at why is he, he got his bags crying and all. Is your granddad home? Oh dang. Granddad, Mr. Dubois at the door. <laughs> you <was a> bitch. <laughs> well, John, I'm sorry to hear about the split. I would love to let you crash it, but I just don't know where you would stay. Maybe the guest room. Said a guest room. <laughs> Who told yeah. you about the guest room? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Robert. See, boy, see why I tell you marriage is bad. I don't care what Damn. nobody say. I ain't never getting married. He said, like, I ain't never getting married, you know. Statistically speaking, it was bound to fail anyway. <laughs> he really... She cheated with Usher, and now he's singing her, his songs. That's what? Crazy. Oh, yeah, that's backwards. 
he might be the art his favorite artist too. And imagine you getting would you get mad that your your husband cheated on you with his favorite artist and it was a woman? Of course. Dang, who's your of favorite course. artist? Who's your favorite artist? Is a woman. Oh, it changes. I'd say right now, Billie Eilish probably. Billie Eilish, you would you would be so mad at him if he cheated with Billie Eilish. I mean, she's really young, so that'd be weird as fuck. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's over eighteen. She's like nineteen or twenty Wait, something. Did she just turn twenty one? Actually, yeah, she's not that I young. She's know. she's legal, bro. So I mean, he good. <laughs> He's good. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I'll be mad too, though. Honestly, I don't care if he's a celebrity. Man, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe. What can you say about Boondocks for the first? Time? I know it's uh, I know it's all over the place, but what can you say for the first time? Because I know you was laughing. Yeah, so this was my first time watching Boondocks. Uh, I thought it was really funny. I think I have seen like maybe a clip or so in like a YouTube compilation. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, this show is great. I would love to see more of it. Um, and yeah. Yeah, she would like to see more, but y'all hit the like button for us to see some more of that and she react to it with me. Hit the like button, subscribe. Her social media be in the description. She's a Twitch streamer, so she streams a lot. How often do you uh, stream? I stream about five times a week on Twitch. Usually Dang. going live between like 11 p.m. and like 1 a.m. at night. Dang. Five, whoa. And hey, you putting them hours, though. You got to support her, man. She's young, up and coming. I love you guys. And like I said, hit the like button, subscribe if you want to see some more. And I know you guys probably going to say, oh, react to the full episode. Some of these episodes could be blocked. But not only that, send comment the next video we should react to next. Because we're going to read the comments, though. We for sure are. I love you guys. Yeah, I read every comment. Yeah, so when y'all leave a comment, she, gonna, she probably going to follow you back. Follow her on Instagram, too, though. But I love you guys. See y'all next video. Let's go.